The roll call of guests cuts across the business and political spectrums. Also in attendance are family members and friends. It's about Chief Olajile Fajemiroku and the birthing of his brainchild, the making of me. The book on one hand is a compilation of his life's journey. The chairman of the occasion aptly describes positive characters identified with the author. I have always known Oladili, the great grandson of Balagbide, to be fearless, perhaps ruthlessly frank, detailed, with very sharp memory, expansive sense of humor, and we therefore I think we produce a book worthy of study, particularly by our youths intending to make something useful out of life. More importantly, the book focuses more on Chief Fajamiroku's strides in the business world and the factors that enabled him. As it has been observed, talent does what it can, but genius does what it must. Whether you like this self-driven man or you don't, whether you endorse his ruthless boardroom wars, his fierce independence of spirit, and contempt for emotional incontinence, when it comes to critical decisions about human company he gives or companies he shares, you have to give it to him at the end of it all that this is indeed one hell of a man. You can work hard, very, very hard for many, many years and be falling and falling and falling and then things go right eventually and you become an overnight success. And so because of this tendency to see the overnight success, we have a culture of instant gratification that does not quite recognize that at the heart of enterprise is delayed gratification. And I think in reading uh, the thoughts of our dear author, we get to learn this plenty. The author attributes his inspiration to write, to interactions with friends and business associates, as well as students. After I finished lecturing and the question and answers, is he ran after me and said, I thought we were in the same class. I said, the reality is what we have heard here. What we, we were in the class to read the books and the theories. But what happens on the field is always very different. And that marked, that marks the essence of this book. I have never, never, never been afraid of falling down. You can never see me down. And that is the dictum I, I, I use all the time. The 200-page autobiography is divided into 17 chapters. The author believes that it will serve as a source of inspiration to those who desire to excel in the business world.